Good design needs to fulfill its purpose, and it should be obvious how you're going to use it. And the other aspect is the emotional side of it. It appeals to you, and you really like it. It takes a lot of great minds to come up with something like Vera. The first question that we asked ourselves was who do we actually design this vehicle for when there is no cab and no driver in the picture anymore. And what we figured out was there will still be human interaction around and we are actually designing for a greater context, which is the society. So Vera will work with people and for people. When you are working with an idea that's never been done, it's always scary in the beginning. Vera is a very high-tech product, but what does all this technology mean to the people out on the streets? One strength that designers have is to give the technology a meaning, a story. We don't do the technology for its technological sake. Having that in mind, we really try to integrate all this fine technology to the design of the vehicle. The dark parts are representing the technical side of Vera. And it starts with the brain over here. This is where the intelligence lies. This area is the most important part on the vehicle. Therefore, we decided to put the iron mark and the slash on top of it. The light surfaces are representing the human side of the vehicle. We kept it rather soft and simple, so it feels approachable and not too heavy on the road. Look at the headlamps over here. We came up with this great idea of combining the graphics with the light, so the light appears to shine through the body and create this iconic V-lights. The side surfaces, we kept it rather simple and soft, but we've used some scallops to highlight the backbone. This surface continues to the front and creates these fenders. It appears like a shoulder and giving some confidence to the vehicle. It gives us that trust feeling that it's able to pull those tones behind it. The rear end of Vera is very iconic and we wanted to create something recognizable instantly. The biggest challenge is to work on an idea that's never been done before you know that what you're gonna create would be the first one and would be looked at. I've seen so many people taking selfies with Vera. To me, that means that we actually managed to give her a soul. It just feels that they acknowledge Vera almost as a person.